All right. Hi, guys. All right. We are going to set up a survey today in Zoho Survey. Customer feedback is really valuable. And although constructive criticism can be a little difficult to receive for some people, it is golden. The reason is because it can help you make your business better. And who better to take the advice from than someone who's experienced your business like your customer or your employees. So you can set up surveys for either uh, customers or employees using Zoho Survey. And I'm going to show you how to do that. But before we do, can you please click the little bell to subscribe so that we can reach more people because our goal is to show as many people as possible how to maximize the use of their Zoho system. All right, so the first thing we're going to do, I'm going to show you how to access a Zoho survey. So if you're using Zoho One, you already have Zoho survey. If you don't see it here in the left menu, then you will add it. You will go in and actually, um, you know, add new applications to your Zoho One first or add it as a new application. And then you should be able to access it. You should see it here. Uh, right here is the icon. And once you go in here, let's see here, I'm going to go to the very beginning of this and see all surveys. Um, you will see a list of all of the surveys. So all the surveys that have been done. Um, and I think they can be created by several people in your organization and you should still be able to see everything if you have admin access. Okay, so what we're going to do, I'm going to show you first how to create a survey and we're just going to select a category and create. This is what I want you to see. On the left hand side you've got a lot of options. You have many question types to choose from. So anything from drop downs to image selections. Um, you can even add contact information if you want to gather their you know name, email address and so on. Um, so you have a ton of options. Here under settings is where you have where you can add a header or a footer, terms and conditions and things like that. You also have the ability to customize a theme that fits your brand. So you can go in and change colors and change the look and feel so that you can um, use that same theme every time you you know publish a survey. Here the hub is where you can set up integrations. Um, just a nugget, you can integrate Zoho Survey with Zoho CRM so that you can send surveys from the CRM. As you can see, you have some other options as well. And then under launch, this is where you'll publish. And then once it's published, you'll see, you know, some other options as well. All right. So when we go back to all surveys, we're going to click on this one, an employee satisfaction survey. When you first go in, the dashboard will show you how many responses you've had, when it was published, and when you receive the last response. Um, it's got some charts and graphs so that you can get an idea of the responses that you've received, how many questions and how many pages, and so on. Um, you can look at the summary of responses for all responses. It'll show you how many survey visits you've had and give you charts and graphs for each question. So each question you'll see an overall rating on how that particular question did. Uh, so you can go in and, um, you know, you'll see maybe it may be a pie chart or graphs or what have you, just depending on the type of question that it was. All right, so you'll see that here. Then you can also look at individual responses. This is where you can see where, um, you, you know, like each response and what they chose for each of the questions as the answers. You can see the, the answers right here. And in order for you to see the, um, I'm going to go here you're going to get a link. Now this link, you can send this link to your customers for them to complete the survey. And then your other option is to click here where it says, as embed, take the code and create a, a page on your website where you can embed this survey. So you can go to you know, yourwebsite.com 
slash survey or customer survey have this embedded and then they can complete the survey there. So those are a couple of ways for you to do that. You can also access Zoho survey just by clicking on survey.zoho.com and it'll take you straight there. And, um, you know, as I mentioned before, you can in, uh, integrate it with Zoho CRM. You can create a workflow that will um, include the survey with an email. You would just put in the email template. And then when someone completes that survey that's in your CRM as a contact, it will attach it to that contact so you can see the results of the survey, you know, for that person. And it'll be, I think it's a PDF that will attach to that, that customer or employee. All right, so let's preview the form. All right, you know, I want to show you guys how it would look with the um, logo at the top. But here you can see this is what the questions look like for the user, the person who's taking the survey. And then let's go back to this one so you can see how this one looks. Here you've got a logo, right? You can add your logo to the top. Here are the questions whatever type of questions you want, submit. You notice the other one had a footer, uh, actual Zoho footer. You can have that removed and then, you know, you can put your own footer or you can just skip the footer altogether. But all of that is customizable. All right. Uh, so, yeah, you can go in and use these responses to make your business better. There's nothing like getting direct feedback that's helpful. And that's the reason, you know, for doing surveys. Not everyone will participate and that's okay. But those who do, it could be extremely, extremely helpful. All right. So if you guys have any questions, just drop it in the comments. I'll do my best to answer. And if you haven't already, be sure to download our ebook because that ebook will help you to set up your own system instead of hiring if that's what you choose to do and then also you will be invited to our Facebook group our private Facebook group where you can ask questions and we can you know collaborate and maybe help you in the areas that you need for your Zoho system then you also have at the bottom of the screen learn.successfulsolutions.com which is our academy where you can take some free courses and then soon we'll have some other uh, paid courses to um, to help you guys as well. So until next time, thank you guys for joining me today.